to third. Backhanded by the shortstop. One got a hurry. Got him. Yes. 479. Love the mark. 500 saves for Trevor Hoffman. What an exciting year for you. Can you just take me through what the whirlwind has been like since you received the news? Yeah, the journey's been a crazy one. Something I don't really prepare for, even though you're quietly preparing. Things are starting to become real. And the, that reality of uh, making sure things are taken care of at home before you leave, speeches, clothing, the tire for different <laughs> events, uh, how it's going to kind of all run, and not just for one day, but for three or four straight days is going to be a pretty intense emotional experience that, uh, you know, I can't wait for it, but I, there's a part that I will enjoy when it's done to kind of look back and, and take a deep breath. And I know you were able to take a tour of the Hall of Fame. Is it crazy to imagine that you're going to be in there, it's going to be you? You know, they had a portion where we got to see certain artifacts and some part of the exhibit, and then you kind of went through the middle part of the museum, and there was this picture of the original class and how they were standing. And there's a particular area that you can sit, and so like you're sitting with that original class. And it was, it just it boggles my mind to think of a Babe Ruth and a, a Walter Johnson and a Cy Young. I mean, just to be benching in those names and then to actually see p pictures of them, and then you're actually considered a Hall of Famer with them, it's just, I don't know, it, it, it's going to take a while to get my mind wrapped around that. And you're going to be part of a very unique class just being yeah. the sixth pitcher that's in a reliever role to be inducted. I mean, do you wrap your head around that when you look at some of the other guys yeah, that have come before you? Really proud of the accomplishments that those guys were able to do in the game and to be part of that small selective group. I'm wondering if we have our own table, <laughs> you know, they talked about Tony going to the the hit the little singles hit table, you know, don't sit next to the, the the power hitters like Hank and everybody else. And so it'll be. I'm, I'm assuming there'll be like a closer table. So I'll hopefully it'll be five guys, six guys sitting there. I'll just get another seat. So it'll be perfect. perfect. That'll be fun. So have you been working on your speech, yep. and what is that process like? Not been easy. Um, most speeches that I've given at any particular event, it's it's kind of bullet points. It's a skeleton, and you know, it's kind of ad lib. You kind of speak off the cuff of particular areas and so one I've always kind of searched like how am I going to fill the amount of time that's flipped it's like how am I going to condense my career into 10 minutes and then put, put it basically verbatim um, word for word and so that's a little bit different it's the process has been fine just you know big pillars and work around it and the outline set and get it all done.